Hello friends, in this particular experiment, we are going to investigate the reactivity of aluminium. The topic of our study associated with this experiment is the reactivity series. Students add aluminium cooking foil to copper 2 sulfate solution and observe the reaction. Then sodium chloride is added and dissolved. You can see a vigorous displacement reaction occurring and the solution gets very hot. Aluminium dissolves and red copper is visible. Aluminium does not show its true reactivity until the oxide layer is disturbed. Sodium chloride disturbs this oxide layer. Scratches on the surface of the oxide layer allow the chloride ions to react with aluminium. This affects the cohesiveness of the oxide layer and this allows reaction with the copper to sulfate. Copper looks like brown so you can look out for this formation of copper as the reaction progresses. So the procedure for this experiment is to measure 20 cm cube of copper 2 sulfate solution into the conical flask. Add a square of aluminium foil and look for signs of reaction. Initially there won't be any reaction. You can see that the aluminium foil remains unreacted with copper 2 sulfate. But the moment you add sodium chloride and stir to dissolve it you can observe certain changes taking place. If you don't see any reaction, you can add a little more of the sodium chloride. But here, there is clear visibility of copper being formed in the reaction. You can see a dark patch on the aluminum foil. Okay, so the deposits of copper have started forming and the blue color of the initial solution is slowly fading away. This is because the copper ions present in the copper sulfate solution is turning to metal copper and getting deposited on the aluminum foil. Okay, so you can see the black specks of copper breaking out, out from the aluminium foil. So this is a clear indication of a displacement reaction taking place. Aluminium is more reactive. But initially the reaction was not happening because of the oxide layer. So once the oxide layer is disturbed by adding sodium chloride, you can see that aluminium is displacing copper from copper sulfate and aluminium sulfate is formed. So the aluminium foil is disintegrating as the reaction progresses and copper is formed in the reaction. I hope you found value in this experiment and for more experiments like this you can subscribe to my channel and it's an easy and very simple experiment to demonstrate the reactivity of metals. Always the more reactive metal will displace the less reactive one from the compounds. Thank you for watching.